Hey there, Yasir here from LightFunnels and in this video we're going to talk about how to sync your LightFunnels orders to your Shopify account so that whenever you get a new order on your LightFunnels account the same order will show up on your Shopify account and this will be very useful because it will allow you to keep using the same system on your Shopify backend where you are using apps to manage your orders, you are fulfilling from a, a third party service or you have a supplier connection. So what we are going to demonstrate here will allow you to keep using the same uh, backend that you are already using on Shopify. Now we are adding more and more integrations to our LightFunnels backend but everyone's use case is different so uh, chances are you may be using uh, some kind of app that's not very popular on Shopify so um, this will be very useful for you to be able to keep using the same app on your Shopify store now to get this started what we need to do is go ahead and install the Shopify app on uh, the back end of your LightFunnels account and to do that it's very simple I got it already installed here I'm gonna un uninstall it so you come here and you click install next to the Shopify app you grant the permissions and now what you need to do is click connect Shopify store all right so the first thing you need here is your Shopify domain. So I'm using this, this Shopify store. This is a development store. So we copy the domain here without the protocol, just the domain like this. And I will paste it here. And the second thing we need is the access token and the app secret. Now, the way you're going you, you're gonna to get these is from your Shopify admin panel. You will go to settings and you will look for apps. Now at the very bottom, you may have many apps installed here, but at the very bottom, you will see uh, the custom apps area. Just click develop apps. You may see a, a different message asking you to enable custom apps development, just enable them. And then you, you will get the option to create an app. So we're gonna create the app and call it Light Funnels create app. Now, the second thing we need to do here is to configure the admin API access. Now in here, we need to give some scopes to Light Funnels. The first scope we need is product read. So this is very important. Make sure you check read products. The second scope we need is write orders. This will allow us to create new orders through the Shopify API. Now we click save and then we're going to go back to the overview and we're going to install the app. Install. And this will give us an access token, an API key and an API secret key. So we will start with the access token. We'll copy that and we will paste it here. And then we're going to grab the app secret from here, copy it and paste it here. And that should be it. Now let's save. Now the second thing we need to do is we need to connect one of our funnels to the, to this store. This will allow us to, uh, have multiple store connections and each funnel can be connected to a different store. So, what we do is add a connection and I will choose this Nike shoes demo funnel that I created just for this video. And I will select my store here and I will create connection. Now, the second thing we need to do, and this is very important is to have the same products on light funnels and on Shopify. The way we do that is by going to products and we choose the product that we want to use. So for example, I want to sell this uh, test product. And I will open the same product on Shopify. And in here, you can see that I have the same product. So you can create products like uh, manually, no problem. You don't have to import or export any product. All you need to do is have the same SKU ID on your Shopify um, product and on your LightFunnels product. Okay, by having the same ID, and this ID can be anything, this really depends on your system, you can just give it a dummy ID if you want. So this SKU has to be the same. This way, when the order comes to Shopify, Shopify picks the same product because it knows that, that using the SKU. Okay, uh, something else that we need to talk about is uh, the SKU on the variants. So variants can have different SKUs as well. So if, you, if we have, for example, color, and let's say black, uh, blue, red. So if we have this, these colors right here, you will see that each color has a different SKU. So if you have multiple variants on your product, you, you want to make sure that you have the same SKUs on, for each variant as the ones that you have on light funnels. So add option and let's call this color and black, blue, red. So you can see that the same here if we scroll to the right, you will see that we have SKUs. So uh, you want to make sure that 
uh, black, blue, red. So black has this, should have the same uh, blue, red. So blue should have the same ID. Copy that, paste it here. And red should have the same ID. So that's how you map your products. Uh, so that whenever an order is sent from Light Funnels to Shopify, the order on Shopify will pull the same product from the, the Shopify products. All right. So for this demo, we're just going to use uh, the main SKU on the product. So we don't have variants for this product. So we can discard this and cancel this as well. So we cancel that. Okay. So we have this SKU and this product has this SKU. So always make sure you have the same SKUs on your products. If you don't have the same SKUs, the order will still come in, but the products on the order will not be known. They will be like custom products with, without the same image. So always make sure you have the same SKUs on both the product and the variants. All right, so to give this a test, we are going to go to funnels and I will pick this Nike shoes demo that I created for this tutorial. So this is a very basic funnel that just has this product and we are going to create an order using this product. So I will click buy now and I will enter my information, keep it cash on delivery so that I don't have to pay right away for this order because this is just a test order. Now confirm my order and it's going to take me to the thank you page. And you can see that if I go to the orders page and refresh, you can see that a few seconds ago, I have this new order that has this product with this SKU. Now, if we go to Shopify and refresh, you will see that a new order was just created for me. All right. This is four minutes ago. I just like I was testing this four minutes ago and you can see that on here also four minutes ago, I have another order, but this is the latest one and it shows up on Shopify as well. Now from here on Shopify, you can use uh, your apps to fulfill this or do whatever you want the same way you usually do on your uh, Shopify account. Something to note here is that Shopify will not charge you any fees for the orders that are synced from Light Funnels because these are orders that are created um, via import using the API. So Shopify does not charge any fees on these, on these orders. All right. So this way you can still use your Shopify integrations while enjoying the high AOVs that you can get from your light funnels funnels. All right. I hope this video was helpful to you and I will talk to you soon. Bye bye.